Hey everyone, awesome Disney toys here, and today I'm bringing you a Just Like Home Microwave. You can actually try it out before even opening it. That's pretty cool. <laughs> Looks like we have some chicken in the microwave. I can't wait to microwave other things. It's all done now. The back of the box shows us different sets we can get. I want to collect them all and make a Just Like Home kitchen. Let's start by opening the box. Ooh, look at all these food items we have. Yum, the pizza looks good. And here's our microwave. Let's start by getting these items out. Whoa! That's a lot of burger pieces. Here we have some buns. And a patty. Some lettuce. And tomato. Oh, and can't forget the cheese. I love cheese in my burgers. And here's a croissant. Perfect for the mornings. Let's see what else we have. And here's that tasty pizza I saw earlier. It looks like combination pizza. And here's a sunny side up egg. It looks perfectly cooked. Ooh, and a hot dog. The bun and the sausage come apart. That's pretty cool. Time to take a closer look at this microwave. Oh, but first we gotta get the chicken out. This plastic's being a little stubborn. Got it. And here's a chicken. Let's start by cooking the chicken first. Here's a plate I have from a different set. We'll just place it right on top. And then place it in. The microwave has different pictures of different foods. We're going to be clicking the chicken leg. Wow, look at how fast the time goes down. I just love how the microwave actually spins around. That'll cook the chicken evenly on all sides. Be careful when taking it out, it could be hot. Yikes. Let's do our pizza next. Some people like cold pizza, but I prefer to warm mine up. The microwave has a pizza button. All you do is click that and press start. It's pretty easy. Pizza is one of my favorite foods. If you guys like pizza, give this video a thumbs up. Nice, our pizza's done. It smells pretty good. Let's do our hot dog next. I think only the sausage needs to be warmed up, and then we can put it in our bun after. Unfortunately, there's no hot dog button, but we'll just click the popcorn since it's the least amount of time. That looks perfectly cooked to me. We'll just place it in our bun and it's ready to eat. Let's do a croissant next. It's perfect for breakfast time. You can have it with your milk or coffee. I like to put butter or jam on my croissants. 
Ooh, or put some ham and cheese inside. That'll make for a great sandwich. Yum, my croissant's all done. Time to warm up our buns. <laughs> Whoops, I'm trying to run away. Oh man, it fell again. That's okay. I can't wait to put our burger together. Careful, the buns could be hot. Oops, that one just really doesn't want to stay on, does it? Here's a pan I have from a different set. This is where we're gonna cook our patty. We'll just give it a little shake. Can you hear that sizzle? Let's flip it around so we can cook it evenly on both sides. Time to put our cheese down. We want to put it down first so when the burger lays on top, it'll melt it and be all delicious. Sometimes I like to put eggs in my burger. We'll cook this one over easy. Let's see if I can flip this egg. Ready, go! Yes! That worked out great! How do you guys like your eggs? Let me know in the comments. <laughs> the egg's a little slippery. I love putting veggies on my burger. It's healthy and delicious. Our burger's all done. Here's a mold I have from a previous set. We're gonna be making a drumstick and a steak. I'll be using some of this brown Play-Doh. Let's just grab a little bit of it. We'll make our steak first. This one looks like a T-bone steak. We just fill it in on both sides, just like that. <laughs> I need a little more. How many of you guys like steak? It's great for dinner and for barbecues. Give this video a thumbs up if you do. We'll also use some of the brown Play-Doh to make our drumstick. and then a little bit of white to make the bone. Mmm, this set is making me hungry. Time to squish it together. Press down as hard as you can, okay? Yum, that looks good. And here's our steak. Let's get our drumstick out. We'll just peel off the edges. Mmm, this one looks perfect. Let's first cook our drumstick. Our drumstick actually looks just like the picture we have on here. So we'll click it, and then press start. And then we wait for it to be finished. It's starting to smell really good. Nice, it looks perfectly cooked. Let's do our steak next. Both these items are perfect for dinner. Our microwave also has a picture of a steak. We just click it, and then press start. And there it goes. Yum, it looks nice and juicy. And here's everything we made. 
This set was so much fun. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to subscribe to see more. Thanks! Also, if you haven't done so already, be sure to follow me on Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter. The links are in the description box below.